This playthrough is rated T for teen. Episode 23, Devin Emerges. Greetings and salutations, viewers, while I'm back here with another episode of Super Robot Tyson OG. In the last episode, the two leaders of the, the well, I guess Ryusei is technically not the leader. Now there's Kiyosuke, I guess. He's a sub leader. But anyway, two of the main characters came together and, and clashed, and they found out that they were even, even though realistically, like, Kiyosuke is probably initially better. But anyway, uh, they, uh, they, you know, are merged together to finally form Voltron. I mean, the, the main core of the group. So, but let's see what's going on now. Captain, we've arrived at White Star, we, where we lost contact with the spy plane. White Star? It's the code name of that large object. That? Yeah, that's pretty large. I see a fitting code name. Dude, please search for this missing spy craft. Yes, Captain. What is it? A rapidly approaching object for the White Star. What? Uh-oh. Arrogators on the spider forms. That's... It's an AGX-02 spider. I ran into it on a previous mission. Yeah, at the very beginning of the game. Then they must be operating for the White Star. Most likely, and they took down the spy craft. Exclamation point. What should we do, Captain? Deploy Gigan and Katina's unit. All hands rig for battle. But wait for power to attack. Yes, Captain. It's Katina, so... Yeah. Just my luck to end up in enemy territory. Scared? Then get off the Gigan. Be scared never. It's my chance to test my luck. I'm better with the Gigan. Well, that's not true. Besides, your, yours has a custom paint job and is meant for aces. Man, am I jealous. Then I'll paint the Gigan with your blood. Now, now, enough bickering. Octo one, I'll open up a path. That means all yours. Lieutenant, our orders were to... Shut up! If you disobey me, I'll use your blood for Giga too. You were serious about that? But, Lieutenant! You know we need to get the upper hand. But we're only supposed to collect enemy data. And the other teams aren't there. That's exactly my point. We have to compensate. We don't know what we're getting ourselves into. So we should get the data first. I agree with Radha. I admire your bravery, but isn't this a bit much? These aren't only enemies, they're arrogators. Yeah, we won't have a fighting chance. That's right, Katina. I'll show you how to relax. Oh no, not yoga. Of course, it's good for your mind. Are you trying to sabotage us? Now let's go. Katina, wait. It's useless, Rana. I guess so. Should we go to... Definitely. I hope they'll be okay. Well, it's always like this. The rest is up to them. Wow, Katina really doesn't take, uh, doesn't take the chain of command very well or something like that. Anyway, yeah, we're back with uh, Radha, uh, Russell, Tatsuki, and Katina. Unfortunately, they've been reset back to their default mechs, so hopefully before the mission, you customize their mechs, because the game allows you to put weapons back on them or put parts on them and stuff like that, which I did off-screen. Uh, Tatsuki, I gave him the generator and the solar panel. Uh, Radha, I gave her a bunch of Apogee motors and a, and a, to move farther. Uh, Russell, I gave him... A uh, bunch of uh, uh, support stuff as well. Boosters and hybrid armor. Not that you need to. This fight's a little bit more difficult on the uh, Ryusei path because you've never used these characters before. So it's kind of a... a, a, a you have to just go by their stats and what their build is. So, But uh, Katina, yeah. I gave her biosensors and server motors so she wouldn't get damaged because she's under the, uh, NPC control now. So she could possibly die. So we just need to make sure... To heal her with either uh, Radha, I gave her the supply module, or uh, uh, Lafina here. So, anyway, right now we've got five, or sorry, six spider enemies. So let's deal with them as as we should. All right, let's try to get a uh, Totski in the main line of fire, and obviously we want to set uh, these two into support mode. So that way they can uh, help each other. We also don't want them to get tagged. We want Totski to be t uh, tagged at the Giga Scundo, so. Alright. Thank you for telling me, game. Now yeah, we'll just defend. Yeah, there's the spiders. The Legion of Spiders! Ah. Even though that wouldn't have really done any damage. Uh, 
Uh, your guy probably hit me with spider web. And this will also build up Giga Skendo's uh, willpower so we can uh, uh, get like Giga Blaster going and stuff like that. Yeah, unfortunately, Katina's probably going to gank a lot of kills during this. Oh well. Not much I could do about that. I mean, we could have given her no weapons, but nah. Alright, probably could cast gain on you. Uh, probably could do luck as well. We really don't need to worry too much about, uh, about striking. We're probably going to hit most of these guys just by ourselves. Yeah, see, we can hit at 100%, so let's just take advantage of that with, like, luck and stuff like that. Give, us, give ourselves a little bit of extra money. And we should be able to do enough damage with auto cannon. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, we're not going to gain too much experience here. This is just to give a little bit of extra pilot points and experience and money for those characters because uh, we were with the other three for a few turns, so. Uh, yeah, it's a good chance to get us some extra cash. But you have luck, so you could just, uh, see, you didn't do any damage, so do you have blaster yet? Probably not, nope. Oh, looks like you don't even have a sheath yet. How much willpower? Ugh. Get some pilot points for uh Yeah, you don't really need the levels. You guys are actually pretty high level by this point. <laughs> You're not gonna gain much of the way of experience, so really this is more of a case of getting money more than anything. Oh yeah, and uh she got this a while back, but uh she got a uh, hope now, so she could actually replenish people's H uh, SP by 50. So she can restore SP, yay! And it's uh, with, and she's got SP regen, so she can as soon as she gets mental, uh, she'll be able to like give people SP. Like that's awesome, you know. That but that's why it costs 70. So yeah, a little little pricey, but hey. That might not finish him up. Oh, close. Oh, I forgot to go over the, uh, um, what the objectives are. Basically, the objectives are to finish off the enemies in five turns, so. All right. Enemy back abuser here. We'll end up at the spy craft unless we retreat. But we won't be able to recover our mechs from here. We also risk leading them to other sectors. What should we do? Or what should we? The captain will make that decision. Dot, dot, dot. We'll try to flee when there's a break in the attacks. A white decision, Captain. As usual. Good. Have Katina retreat to our position. Yes, Captain. Here you custard out to one. Retreat. Well, but there are still enemies. Remaining enemies. It's the captain's orders. Don't worry. I'll defeat them all. Every last one. Wait, Lieutenant, what should we do, Captain? Dot, dot, dot. We have no choice but to chase after her now. <sighs> I suppose so. Any other group, she we get, she get, uh, you know, put in the brig for disobeying orders like this, but, uh, you know. But anyway, yeah, we got, uh, yeah, all enemies shot down in winning conditions, uh, losing conditions, continue shot down, mothership shot down, which I don't know what's called mothership, is the Hiri custom, but whatever. Uh... And then map cleared within six turns of the battle requirement. Like I said, it's harder on Ryu Say's path because you don't have already built up max and stuff like that by this point, or at least leveled up characters. So, and I probably should have her move into the the group. So, oh yeah, I think everyone's getting quite a few levels too. Actually, in between the episodes, can I remember us being the high level level by this point? So they gave us a few extra levels to make up for them not being available for a couple of turns. Right, I probably have to heal you actually. 
Might just do that. Because they're most likely going to go after you or Katina because of your uh, uh, build, so. Eh. Uh, <clears throat> I'm just trying to think of the. Oops, I didn't mean to use guard. I meant to use a uh, strike. I meant to use a. Uh... Do you have Street Thunder yet? Finally. Well, I'm gonna take care of the top, so. I just need to know where you can do. Okay. Actually, it might be better to go down here. Yeah, there's almost, like I said, we're not going to gain much in the way of uh, experience because these guys are so low level. Might as well just try to get money out of it. Oh, yeah, these are just uh, um, regular bug enemies. So, nothing. Actually, I think they're the next step in bug, actually, the ones that are a little bit more powerful. Oh, and the reason why Katina's hit from so far away is I gave her the. Uh, uh, hyper beam rifle, so she can hit from really far away. Probably shouldn't do that if you're trying not to uh, get her gate experiences, but. Five points to wrestle. Also need stuff for. I need a good level for uh, to, or a good space to give a person pile points, so that way we can get mental for her. And she's not too far away. She only needs thirty to get uh, mental, so and that way she could use hope on a well, not regular basis, but just enough. So what level are we on? Four. The next set of enemies appear. More of them? Well, we're close to H enemy H school. How can you be so calm? At this rate, we'll be goners. With Dick Katina, we won't last long. We have to retreat. Not yet. We can still fight. You don't get it, do you? If we retreat, we fail. So go ahead and run if you want. Jeez, if only Kyosuke or Valetta was here. Ugh! What the? Did you feel that, Tatsuki? Yeah, I have a bad feeling about this. Captain, our sensors indicate gravity tremors. Because of the reinforcements? No, it's... Shoe? Oh my god. It's the DC's grandson from the Hagane Report. What's it doing here? Huh. Oh man, I hate to say it, but I was right. If it's a DC, then it's an enemy. Attack! I'm afraid you are mistaken. Mistaken? You've broken toss with the DC? Yes. Do you think I'm stupid? Can't you invent a better lie? Why not say you want revenge for Bowie and mayor? Is this what I can expect from the inhabitants of Earth? Incidentally, I was asked by those two to save you. Save us? Do you expect more gratitude? I think he's telling the truth. Exclamation mark, question mark. But his true goal is to observe the White Star. I'm glad Captain Daitetsu's right hand man is so smart. Well, don't mind us. Please go about your business. Hey, XL, you're making me look bad. Now, now, this war is not about status. But Professor Shu Shirakawa, if you intend to join us in battle, you better be prepared. Very well. Now I shall learn where the aliens of White Star truly come from. came from. All right, Shu is temporarily an NPC. If anyone attacks him, he'll, insta he'll basically insta-kill them. He's in a, a mech called the Grandson. I'm trying to remember if we interact with him on the Kiyosuke route at all. I think we heard about him, but never actually ran into him. Uh, Ryusei deals with him a couple times. 
but he's in the grandson a really powerful mech he's got warp field energy regen s which is like uh, 30 uh, regen, uh, 30 energy per turn uh, he's got spirit block uh, he does have great mobility but he's got really high armor he's got s's and everything he's piled by shu shurikawa uh, overall not crazy high stats it's mainly his mech that really gets him all of his power uh, he's got sense guard guts valor and spirit which won't do anything because he don't NPCs don't use that. I, I gotta stop mentioning that because it's obvious. Uh, he's got Genius, Revenge, SP Regenerate, and Counter Level 2. And weapon wise, he got Energy Drake, Graviton Gun. He'll never use the map ability. And in the later re releases of this game, I think they actually have him use this ability at some point. But he's got the Grand Sword for melee, Wormhole Attack for ranged combat, Black Hole Cluster for his big, big hitter. But any of these attacks will instantly destroy these creatures. But yeah, they're new, new ones. Yeah, they're right bird-like. I thought they were going for insects for all the creatures. Huh. Well, okay then. If you say so. Let's see. We want to stay in a... Yeah, your command... Because you're level uh, 29 now, you've gained a bit of a uh, bump in your command. You're level 3, so now you hit uh, four tiles in front of you. If everything goes right, we should be able to uh, finish these guys in uh, by turn six easily. Like I said on Ryusei's route, there's a little bit more. You have to you have to be a bit careful because sometimes they might not they might hit the wrong person. You might not counterattack and stuff like that. So wow, I'm surprised they're missing at a ninety percent. That's kind of crazy, actually. Stop killing my kills, Katina. I guess I could have given her no weapons. Well, she's doing that too, so. Captain, there's an object quickly approaching this area. Exclamation point. So they finally appeared. That, that's... I finally found you, Shu. Masaki? God, we haven't seen you since... God, which mission was that? You popped in, attacked things, and disappeared? Like, gosh darn, Jack in the Box? I finally found you, Shu. Masaki, you need to grow up. Shut up! I'm coming for you. You sure you want to do that? Look around you. From my point of view, you're more dangerous than aliens. You haven't changed a bit. You never look at the big picture. You're lucky to be piloting the Elemental Lord. I don't need to hear your crap. I wasn't planning to fight you, but... Wait, Masaki, listen. Who the heck are you? Captain of the Hear You, Lafina Einfeld. I don't know what happened between you and the doctor. Then there's no reason to butt in. I'm sorry. But you should be fighting each other right now. Exclamation point. As you can see, Aragaries are about to invade Earth. We need to protect him by joining forces. Great idea, except that you can't trust him. Surely you heard about the South Pole incident? Yeah, but we have to concentrate on the present. Kent is right! Yeah, if Earth falls and Gaius could be next. What are you gonna do, Masaki? I don't trust you, but Captain Lafita has a point. Da, da, da. If you do anything suspicious, I'll take you down. We shall see. Anyway, Masaki joins the group. He's in a uh, in a side buster. Side bu uh, let's take a look at Masaki. Overall, Masaki is a pretty good pilot, mainly because of the mech he uses in the side buster. He's got uh, two farms. He's got the side buster, and then he's got the uh, side bird. Side bird, you usually want to keep it, keep him on the side bird uh, if you want high avoidance. If you want to actually do damage, you switch him to the side buster. Uh, Masaki comes with uh, focus alert and luck currently. He's got in fight uh, and counter. Uh, obviously, you want to give him like uh, SP regenerate, uh, revenge attacker uh, to build him up a bit. Maybe mental, uh, probably support. Depends on how you want to build him. But but yeah, he's got caloric missile, sci-fi fla side flash, which is a map ability to hit multiple targets. High familiar Zep the Zephyr sword, the Akashic Buster, and Cosmic Nova is his big big hitter so he'll help us uh, finish these guys off so all right i have enough attack for no uh, they didn't attack me enough to get uh oh wait no uh yeah i can only hit him with the side blaster there so actually i could yeah okay uh that'll weaken him i won't finish him off but might as well Uh, yeah, I won't finish him off, but I'll 
guarantee I hit them. I don't care about hitting Shu. Shu can take the hit. I'll take you all. Giga burst. All right. Yeah, we did quite a bit of damage. Okay. Let's see. Just trying to think of who I want to. Let's have Sean cast luck. Well, the turn we have five. Yeah, we'll be fine. Yeah, I tried to get that little extra money, so. Yeah, I'm just trying to think who, well. I just have you guys finish these guys off just to, uh. Yeah, you hardly got hit. How much bless you have left? I can do a couple. Take advantage of while we're good. Oh, I need just so many more pile points. We're so close to get SP regen for Russell. Now yeah, let's let yourself get. Yeah, let's hit you with high familiar. Let's show that off. Yeah, he sends his little cat creatures to attack him in their little uh, uh, familiar things. What? Wait, is that laser where I think it is? Uh, okay. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to swap. I was just going to leave it on the, uh, uh, Sidebuster theme. stealing my kills, but then again, like I said, this is a crazy, this is more just to get a little bit of extra money and pile points with it. Anyway, get the Ballot Master. Yeah, like I said, a lot easier on this path if you've been actually using Russell and Katina and everything like that, so. The enemy has retreated. Now is our chance to retreat. Yes, all PTs return to the ship. We leave at once. I'm done here. The Chosen Ones can take care of the rest. What do you mean, Shu? It's useless to chase me, Misaki. What? I don't plan on making a move anytime soon. You must decide whether or not to believe me. <laughs> you bastard! Well then, best of luck. Wait! Forget it, you can't catch him, you know? Ugh, that bastard, what is he up to? We've escaped with the White Star. And the enemies? There's no sign of them. We're safe for the time being. We can't ease up yet. UCC troops are still in the area. Yes, all hands. Stay at Battle Station 3. Yes, ma'am. By the way, has Misaki responded to our call? Yes, the Sidebuster is on course to land. Then after it lands, shown to the bridge. Understood. Why did you follow my orders? Well, your job is to watch my back. But, but... Oh, come on. You just made the captain's orders, too. That'll be a hundred... No, a thousand lashings. What? That many? If Kyosuke or Veleta were here, it'd be different. There's always so much we could do. But that's why we need to handle it. Okay, okay, what happened to her, what happened to her after Lieutenant Kyosuke and his team left? The Lieutenant. I guess she must have gotten hit pretty badly when they left. I read about you that got a report, and I believe we met before. So what? Cut the chit-chat and get to the point. Captain Daitetsu Pagane wrote highly of you in his report. He called you and the Sidebuster valuable allies. I guess he's smarter than he looks. Fate must have crossed our paths. Will you help us? Yeah, why not? Really? But why are you so surprised? Well, I didn't think I'd get you to agree so easily. If we really are being attacked by aliens, then it'd be stupid for us to fight amongst ourselves. Besides, I doubt Shu will make a move anytime soon. Yeah, it seems like he plans to wait and see what happens. I wonder too, but we have a duty to protect the Earth. So I'll help you guys. Thank you, Misaki. Captain, we received a message from Admiral Norman. What does it say? We hear you custom retreats to the fourth defense line. You were to meet up with Hagane. I just did. 
<laughs> God, it's been six months. Damn, Arrow Gator, speaking of move, huh? The Huyu has the countered enemy units from White Star. Are they okay? Yes, Lafina lacks experience, but she's a natural leader. Also, your former adjutant, Sean Webley, is with her. Very curious. Assigning a novice in our... And, uh, assigning a novice in our mission. Monitor White Star via satellite. Have the Gane meet up with the Huyu custom ASAP. Yes, uh, sir. Our gun assembly complete. I wonder why Rod had Valetta adjusted so he could shoot the Metal Destroyer without the T-Wing system. Ingram's orders were to collect data from multiple pilots, but the power output has been reduced and it's unable to connect to the SRX. I guess it beats not having an AR AUX parts with our gun. Okay, now for the finishing touch of the Huckabine Mark II. Let's call a bullet. You're in a road. Ready to go, the Hagane is about to launch. He's probably Type 2 with Kusaha. What? Boy, some people. Cut him some slack. He's going into combat. All right, then help me with just the Huckabye Mark II. Uh, wide open, my big mouth. Huh, sounds interesting. What do you think? Well, I want to root for both of them, but she's sort of dense. That's what I hear. Honestly, I'm not sure what to do. Huh, I guess all we could do is wait and see. I guess Bullet and Kusa got together after the whole not trying to kill her during the exercise situation, so good for Bullet, I guess. It's all up to them. He just uh, has to land a good one. And then we settle everything? Like I said, they need to resolve it on their own. Sorry, I tend to jump the gun. Looks like Garnet's kind of a gossip lady, you know. Clock a little talk a little, if you know what I mean. But if we leave it up to them, nothing may happen. You shouldn't mess with people's love lives, ladies. Yeah, how about petting her? Aw, oh, that's not right. Petting her? What? I bet you have some stories. Or, er, sorry, I bet you have some stories. Well, I don't mean to brag, but... Cool, we've got to get together for our gossip session. Oh, no, no, stop. <laughs> what are those two talking about? Beats me, that's women for you, but we better go soon. Hey, do you know where Aya went? No, why, is she not at the base? What the heck is she doing now? What is she doing now? Hey, we get another repair. Why does it say restore module? That's a supply module. Anyway, we get another one because now, okay, now, well, everyone was together, but now we got even more people together with like Katina and, uh, and everyone together. So now we need to just start, uh, basically off screen, I have to basically take whoever I'm going to use and put them into my party. So I'm going to take two support characters for sure. Probably going to be Rod Hud and Russell since I've been using them. Uh, Garnet is really good, but because I haven't been using her, I'm probably going to leave it up to Russell and Rod Hud to do uh, support stuff. Even though Garnet's probably the better of the two support compared to Russell. They're comparable. It really depends if you've been building up or not. If you're on the Kiyosuke path, you're probably going to stick with Russell because you've probably been using him. Uh, and same with Radha. Uh, but yeah, Garnet, since she's not used, she'll probably be put in the back line. Maybe if you need a third su uh, support character, or at least someone who could dodge, you might use her. Um, Gaido, he's not going to be used at all because he's just... He's, he's like... I mean, he's not the worst pilot. He's just not good enough. Same with, like... Uh, let's see, who's another character? I, it was like Ryo, Ryoto or whatever his name was. We're not going to use him. So... But I'll do that all off screen overall. But yeah, glad they gave us this two supply parts. So now we can basically we're gonna have two. Basically, we're gonna have two groups. We're gonna have the Taitetsu group with, in the Hagane, and we're gonna have the Hiryu Custom group. And basically, we're gonna use them to work together because of their command. Both captains have command, so we're gonna take advantage of that for evasion and hit purposes to survive the coming uh, battles ahead with our characters. But what's our first mission going to be like with the two groups finally merged together? Will the DC, DC make one, or, or DC or UCC make one last attempt? And what about the people who worked in that group? Not all of them are willing to stick with the group. And how about a new character emerging? Someone that breaks the conventions of the standard model and design of all the robots in this game. But find what happens next time in the next episode of Super Robot Tyson OG. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time.